Okay, so after the last chapter of Black Clover, there's been a lot of uproar. A lot of people on YouTube, for some reason, thinks that everybody was universally, like, accepting and loving of Julius's return. Spoiler alert. But, yeah, we're gonna read some of the comments of people talking about, you know, Julius' return. And also, the whole Black Clover is going to get cancelled party because a lot of people are saying as well oh it's good anyway black clover should get canceled now on top of all these people talking about dropping it so a lot of different things we're going to look at some of the sales of the volumes of black clover and just in general we'll take a deeper dive into what's going on here because to be honest with you uh i, I just don't understand right now like what what's going on with the fandom let's talk about it whether facebook twitter or the two make sure to stay clear because i'm coming through like so the big uproar again in the black clover community has been on julius's return despite the fact that a lot of you seem to think that this is me making it up and i have not seen it so let's read a couple of the comments over on twitter and see what people are saying about it never been the biggest fan of it when comparing it to other shonen but i literally started reading black clover again from chapter one last night and now all i see on my feed is black clover fans getting mad and dropping it i'm curious what could have went so wrong now well th th this is a common thing with shonen uh, anime and manga readers uh, you know wh whenever there's one chapter or one episode that really pisses people off they all start screaming I'm dropping it it's over screw this series and then they're reading the next chapter and watching the next episode the following week so yeah that's kind of common in, in, in this community I've, I've been dealing with it for nine years to so the people dropping black clover witch hat and magi been out read a good magic series don't get me wrong Magi is that greatness, but damn, a little harsh, don't you think? Why is everyone dropping Black Clover? I'm so confused. Everyone was saying it was fire like a month ago. To everyone dropping Black Clover, keep the same energy if Pound or Pedro make it and are still alive, just like Bon Clay and Pell. You gotta boycott One Piece that week. Ooh, I know One Piece fans are gonna go crazy over that one. Like, what are you? I, I ain't gonna lie, that Pell one was BS. Like, uh, uh, Pe Pell, that was BS. And yeah, please don't bring back Pedro. That would really suck. No, Black Clover fans are celebrating. Celebrating Black Clover fans are dropping, not speaking for all of course. Are people seriously dropping Black Clover? Couldn't be me. Dope Black Clover chapter. You drop in the series? Then you are welcome to tell us all about it. Get your retweets, likes, and fuck off. Black Clover greatness. We still here. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. Everyone has a breaking point, so it's fine. I've not read Black Clover in a while, so I also might be dropping it. Talk about a follower, huh? So who's dropping Black Clover now? LOL. Uh, not that many people. Again, uh, in my community, at the very least, most people are like chill with it. And because there's a logical explanation that his you know star on his face it, it represents reincarnation the name of it and stuff like that not that many honestly as always tabata pulled it off and black clover still winning how y'all motherfuckers look after dropping the series off without reading the chapter and just basing on the leaks with a picture of a clown that sounds about right because i i noticed that there was a lot more of an uproar a lot of people simmered down but uh there was more of an uproar when the raws came out seeing that julius was returning before people even got the explanation like that's why you probably should you know not base your judgment off spoilers like if you want to spoil yourself that's fine but how are you going to say something's trash based on a spoiler read some more black clover this morning so i can eventually see why everyone dropping it and calling it mid haha -ha. i have so many mixed feelings towards black clover 214 on one hand it makes sense but on the other hand they didn't need it to happen but i do love lumiere's farewell to secre that was sweet tell me your thoughts also they're not worth dropping the manga people need to chill i like how so many people think people are petty for dropping black clover over this one chapter no it wasn't because of this chapter black clover had a string of horrible chapters at the end of this arc really like last time i checked yeah maybe they weren't as crazy as the prior chapters but the chapters were pretty freaking awesome from when the devil showed up like that was insane and pretty damn awesome of a plot twist so no most people are saying they're dropping it because of the you know whole reveal of of the wizard king returning the new black clover is very interesting and i'm extremely excited for black clover i'm still gonna buy the volumes we ain't dropping black clover those who drop there are not even caught up to black clover and they're just dick riding on the jump ship and hate also dropping because of a leak raw scan they all look like clowns when the chapter was out i'm dropping black clover the plot and the characters are so generic and predictable still trying to catch up to black clover but what's all this noise about people dropping the book i can't believe the number of people who legitimately drop black clover over this imagine dropping a series you're supposed to be a fan of because of spoilers you read before the chapter even dropped if you did you were never a fan at all you're a bunch of cornballs and it goes on and on oh did black clover finally get canceled black clover is canceled party i hate it when people say that shit oh this is canceled like 
But then again, that's like Twitter in a nutshell. I'm curious as to what happened in Black Clover that has people dropping it. Could a kind soul educate me? Well, the character came back and there was foreshadowing and logical explanation for it, but we don't need to go there, huh? So yeah, uh, there was quite a bit of an uproar on it, but for the people that, because there was a few comments in there, I can't find them right now, but people were saying like, oh, the sales aren't doing good anyway, so it's probably going to get canceled regardless. Let's take a look at some of the volume sales for, I, I think it's like the first 19 volumes or so so we can kind of get a better idea and understanding of what Black Clover is selling like nowadays. So when Black Clover started, Volume 1 in total did 38,000 sales, which 38,000 isn't all that much, but between 1 and 2, it almost doubled and went to 61,000, and uh, it went on a steady incline for volumes upon volumes like almost every volume continued to increase whether it be by you know just a thousand or you know by by volume 12 it was already at 149,000 and it seems to at the very least by volume 15 it definitely peaked and since then it hasn't reached that plateau but we've still had pretty damn close sales like volume 15 did 244,635 and volume 19 which I think 20 came out but volume 19 did 231,000 so it's still only about like 13,000 behind and Black Clover has just been getting even grander and the climaxes have been even more exciting so I wouldn't be surprised if these numbers uh, after these volumes go up even further especially the climax of this this big arc that Yuki Tabata did with the devil and the elves and everything. I don't think those volumes have hit shelves yet. You know, they just uh, released those chapters these last couple months. So imagine when those volumes drop. And I ain't gonna lie, that's one of the things why I really sometimes get frustrated with, you know, the fandoms of shonen anime and manga because it gets very toxic. I mean, at the end of the day, you gotta look at it. For starters, Black Clover, it's doing like, you know, 200,000, 300,000 sales uh, per volume, which is great. So they, they're not gonna get rid of it right now don't get me wrong it could do better like you know it, could, it, it would be nice if it was in the millions but it's still it's doing pretty okay uh in the west at the very least i see a very big fan base growing for it and it just seems as though like a lot of the times the fandom gets real bloodthirsty like don't get me wrong fairy tale committed a lot of egregious sins with like bringing characters back because you know friendship and love or having characters defeat characters and it didn't make sense again because of friendship and love and black clover i mean yeah there's friendship involved from time to time we get speeches but in terms of things like major plot points like julius's return or Patri's return it's nothing to do with like oh yeah i came back because i love my friends like it's not that at all you know julius's one was foreshadowed it had an explanation whether you love love it or hate it it doesn't matter it was explained so for people that are saying like it's an ass pool or black clover is gonna get canceled well it's selling okay uh in terms of like you know it having an ass pool that that wasn't an ass pool like an ass pool again is like not so defeating Zeroth because oh, i love my friends baby let's get friendly and no that that that's not the case at all so i'm kind of curious what a lot of you guys think after this chapter again we kind of reviewed and we talked about julius's return but based on everything uh, do you feel as though the Black Clover is cancelled party is warranted? Like, for me, I, I just find it ridiculous. And I, I just don't understand, like, why people, like, especially if you, early on, you've seen what Black Clover was, right? Black Clover has gotten a lot better since then, but when the series first started, it wasn't like it was a masterpiece of writing. You could definitely tell it was reminiscent of a lot of stuff we've seen in the past. And if you were, like, a fairy tale hater, you could see early on that it was kind of like a love child of Naruto and fairy tales. So why would you jump on this series to begin with? And for the people that aren't caught up or just bandwagoning yeah 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 crusty as fuck for that because black clover is greatness this latest arc has been amazing and all of it in general like with with the ending with julius's return like i, I wasn't a fan of pottery's return i'm not gonna lie i mm, i don't really care but julius was explained and in general i think a lot of it is once again bandwagoning and I, i'm kind of tired of that because i've seen it so many times it's like if one popular person or one popular thread or forum says like they hate a chapter or something everyone jumps on it and for crying out loud a, a good chunk of people that were talking about dropping it they were dropping it based on a fucking raw without even seeing what what it was about but that's all happened this one though thanks for watching hope you enjoyed if you liked anything i had to say or enjoyed the video drop me a like i'd greatly appreciate it and if you want more from me make sure to subscribe follow me on twitter instagram hit that bell to get all notifications and if you want to follow any of my other social media links of course in the description below i'm for never world and as always people have an awesome day and remember the golden rule anime and manga for life boy bow have an awesome day
Can't forget the music though. Hold on, let me play y'all a little something. Paper rules, if you heard it, best believe that. For now it's whatever. One day I'll be your favorite for never. No matter how you know, get 